So who did? You I need a can't picky promise. Trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents oh, are that Whoa! Batman. The Telltale series. Alfred, get the car. Anyway, last time when we left off, where did we leave off? Matter of fact, it's gonna show us right about now. So, shh, be quiet. A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. What did I do? I don't remember. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Oh, okay. I don't like the Mr. way he Wayne, touched me, but okay. Thank you for opening your house to us. Together, we will change Gotham. Harvey, I really don't like you. Harvey I said that in the first one too. Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicky Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. Okay, that's big. Carmine Falcone. Carmine. Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Your oh father, yeah, I remember. I got in trouble. Yeah, they saw me shake this guy's hand, and they try to pin everything Don't against you know me. Not to corner a wild animal. It's dangerous. And day number two. Yeah. Bye, Bat. <laughs> Ooh. She this had to go Selena. for the face? Uh, oh, yeah, I remember that's Harvey's girl. It's, uh, How many? Selena Cow. I'd have to count the pieces. Falcone's calling card. This guy's just dropping roses the early? chemicals. Where are they? We're all being played in, including you. Okay, so, yeah, there's a third person involved. I should've just let him go. Like, push him off. It's... The Waynes. <laughs> the Waynes. Well, the Waynes are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. <laughs> Wait, what? The Wades are Waynes, like me, Bruce Waynes. Okay. <laughs> Just a normal day in Detroit. <laughs> Always rains. You guys never been to Detroit? Go to Detroit. Looks exactly like this. <laughs> you don't have to do this. Oh. Only you now, Master Bruce. Wow, this guy really got a plaque engraved on the floor? That's deep. <laughs> I thought you know I many... might find you here. Okay, never mind. The news was upsetting for both of us. But you should see this. Mob money. I know you come here for solitude, Bruce. Behind More Wayne allegations Fortune? about his ties to the underworld. This isn't going away. It's all so public and messy. They're People trashing my family. Are stones at my family, Alfred. I need to understand oh. why. It's my get so family emotional too. About it. Don't forget that. I've been dreading this day for nearly two decades. I, I hoped it would never come. Forget the papers. I want to hear it from you. <laughs> the truth is, they were billionaires, yeah, Bruce. You can't Wait, amass what? that kind of wealth without making certain moral compromises. It's just not possible. That kind of money taints you. You kept their secrets for them. I'm trying to help you understand. Then try harder! <laughs> Alfred, you're... I don't know, Alfred. Been hiding this for so long. The wheels of politics. Falcone was the muscle. Thomas legitimized the whole enterprise with his name. Your father, Hamilton Hill, and Falcone, they were partners. Wow. Nothing okay. So I guess we are corrupt. Without them knowing. Falcone, the papers—they were telling the truth. Everyone knew about this, but me. I know it's a lot to take in. Wow. I want you to know, <laughs> I had my suitcases ready. I couldn't stand to be around your father anymore. Wow, that's deep. Alfred, for you. <laughs> they were killed, and you were all alone. 
Damn, you could have told me sooner, though. Walk out the door. Everything I did, everything I've ever done, was out of love for you. Thanks. <laughs> I hope you can forgive me. Much love. Let me down. We're still family. How could nah. I hold this against you? You're all I've got, Alfred. Yeah, for real. Thank you. I won't let you down again. Yeah, again, Alfred. Don't fuck up this time. You know, strike one. This is the first time I've been back here since that night. When the police called me to collect you, I thought they'd finally arrested your father. I couldn't believe a lowlife thug like Joe Chill would have the audacity to rob and kill Thomas Wayne. He was simply too well known. Joe Chill? Too. too big. Yet, there it was. Uh. If my father was that deep in crime, he would have had enemies. Well, it's a fair assumption. Wait, so is Chill I don't think the dude that helped us in the park? You always I don't remember. said it was a simple mugging. In 20 years, you've never wavered from that story. I can recall every moment of that night in vivid detail. But maybe that's wrong. Sometimes we block out things we don't want to face. Maybe there was some detail I overlooked. Oh, let's go into CSI mode. Let's see what we got. We got the side alley. Okay. Search the alley to remember the past. The plaque. Whoa. Frame rates. Okay. Look at the side alley. I want him standing here. Right now. And what would the Batman do with his own parents' killer? He would beat his ass. He's a frightening. Ask him why. Kill him. I take him to jail. Yeah. Just like any other criminal. But he's not just any criminal, is he? I mean... He was stabbed to death in prison. No one mourns for Joe Chill, Bruce. Oh, wait. So he's already dead? I guess so. But, uh... Yeah, like, I'm not gonna kill him. I wouldn't ask him why, because he just wanted the money. Supposedly. Damn, it's hot. His mom was hot. To protect us. He thought he was invincible. Sadly, he was mistaken. I just... I can't picture him as a criminal. Not the kind yeah. I deal with. In that moment, he was simply your father. That's true. That's true. I, I can't disagree with that. I mean, you don't think of your parents as evil or bad, especially growing up. Well, not me anyway. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Anything down here? Can we go in the club? Hmm. Newspapers. Got the things. Wayne Memorial Auditorium. Okay, what are we doing again? Okay, go. Look at it. I love that movie. I saw it countless times at that theater. How long did it play there? Only when you wanted to see it, Bruce. Your mother arranged the special screenings personally. Damn, they got it like that. I knew that. She was always so good to me. <laughs> you told the squad to come through? My son wants to see the, uh... I don't know what he saw, like Avengers or something. I don't know. Where exactly does the memory end? With my father pleading... You don't have to do this. And the gun fires. And after that? Then uh, there are considerable gaps in that recollection. Hmm. Maybe. Do I, I really want to know? Bruce, like you've been like thinking about this like twenty four seven. You should know like every little detail. Oh, 
Okay. Get the gun, man. Stay back. Take whatever you want. Nothing personal. Just business. Just they business. You, had it coming. You, you don't have to do this. Just business. All right, so he didn't want their money. It was more like someone was gonna pay him more. Oh! Damn! You good? Oh, this is so messed up. And he took the wallet? No, I'm definitely killing him. Well, if he was still alive. I would beat his ass. Bruce, are you all right? That's rough. It wasn't a mugging. They yeah. were assassinated. Guys, and Colin Lanfell Cody knows why. The Batman. Broken Memories. The Tales of the Series, Episode 2. The Batman. GCPD, six, I was at six, damn, I don't know my numbers, 8.56 a.m. Got them PD. Damn, way to fucking shove people out the way. But getting you in to see Falcone like this, I don't have to tell you how many rules we're breaking. Oh, don't is that me wrong, I'm always here for you, but this could land us both in hot water. I pulled all the strings I had with the lieutenant. This better not come back to bite us. You owe me, and Look, I appreciate I get it. That hard, okay, and it means a lot to me. I should have been a dick about I it. I know it does, Bruce. You it doesn't me. make it any easier. The last time you disappeared behind closed doors with Falcone, the press made us pay. At least tell me what this is about. It's about you staying on my business, Look, Harvey. I'm all for blind support, but I should at least know what I'm getting myself into. This is a personal matter, Harvey. Exactly. If I told him it would've been too easy. Fine, don't tell me. But I hope none of this comes back to bite us. I don't want Harvey. headlines taking away from my debate with Hill. Harvey Gentlemen, face. we finally put Falcone in his cage. Now, well, thanks to the information you gave me, Bruce, he won't ever get out. Whoa, I'm sorry. Uh, information? What information? Yo, don't tell him nothing. <laughs> oh. well, I assumed you knew. I was going to contact your office first thing. But uh. everything's been a little busy. I gave him some evidence against Falcone. Uh, exactly. More like a catalog of his entire criminal empire. It's a case that'll put Falcone away for life. <laughs> Is that a fact? It's the reason I said yes to this unorthodox request. I mean... Nice job bringing in Falcone. Yeah, that son of a bitch him. better not get off again. He's not getting off the hook, Rene. Not this time. Mr. Wayne, Sergeant Rene Montoya. I just wanted to oh, say, yeah. you know, some of us police support you, despite what the media is saying. Thanks, Sergeant. Appreciate it. We're keeping Falcone in the infirmary. He's lucky he didn't get roughed up more. I could tell Batman wanted to kill him, but he held back. Dude, that chick's not he blinking. cares about doing the right <laughs> thing. Batman is a hero. I think he's a freak. Well, whoever he is behind that mask, I say Gotham's lucky to have him. Yeah, it's great to know he's out there watching over the city. <laughs> Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> Hopeless place. All right, Falcone's inside. Oh, yeah, I think say we beat him up, right? Say. We'll be out here. I think we tossed him out of TV the last time I remembered. All right, let's visit this hunk of trash. Episode 2. But he's all fucked up. I threw him at like five TVs. Wake his ass up. Children of Arkham. The hell? Bruce Wayne? 
<laughs> I feel like he's gonna you silently must kill have him. Some clout. My own wife can't get in to see me. Good thing I'll be out of here in a week. Just like every other time they tried to put me away. Yeah, let's just skip we need it. to talk, Falcone. You weren't so eager the last time we met, but then yeah. I knew you'd come around. I didn't give Especially a after the press got their teeth into you. <laughs> You're your father's son. Yeah, that's right. Tommy and I were close. Okay. How close? More than friends. More like cousins. Going back decades. Until you sent Joe Chill to kill him. Ah, so that's what this is really about, eh? The pup digging up a 20-year-old killer. Two killings, and they were never forgotten. Give me a confession. You and me, we're practically family. I thought you'd have figured that out by now. I tried to get through to you at Dent's party. But you, you showed me the door. Got a whole closet full of birthday presents I was never able to give you. It's a damn shame you ask me. Ugh. Convince me then. Tell me a story about our big, happy family. Yeah. <laughs> there yeah. it is. Now I got you hooked. Your father, Hill, and me, we ran this city. Still do. <clears throat> God mm. damn this pain. Can't think through it. Morphine's on the side there. <laughs> Be a good boy and help Uncle Carmine out, huh? Can I like jab it into his eyes? <laughs> Real gruesome. <laughs> Yo, inject him like in the lip. Hurt him, ease his pain. Oh, uh, what do I do? I want to see what happens. I am not here to take care of you. You deserve to suffer for what you've done. Bruce is a little too hard, man. Poor play. You'd never know the truth. How much of your old man is in you? What kind of son did he make? I need you alive. But only until I have answers. Facts. Apple didn't fall far, did it? You got that Wayne seed. He loved you, you know. He did it all for you. Answers. He protected his own. But if you got on his bad side... What? Your father was more ruthless than any of us. He had a switch, you know. Still, made us all rich, including okay. you. Some people just have the mind for it. He was one of the most brilliant men I ever knew. So you took him out? Until you hired an assassin to take him out. What, you really think I ordered the hit? Sure, I worked with Joe Chill from time to time. Put a button on someone, he'd take him out. But I never ordered that hit on your parents. So who did? You I need a picky promise. You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents oh, did that. Whoa! What the what fuck? Whoa, she lost her chill real quick. <laughs> what? The bastard had to die. What's wrong with your face? Hands in the air! Stand down! Get a doctor! Secure this floor! No one gets in or out! Go! Yo, Go! Falcone's dead as fuck! What happened? Dude! Is it like a virus?